fellow Realm of Empires. My name is Greg Ball and welcome back to Next Developer Log. Today I'm going to tell you about some of the new realms that we're launching just at the end of the uh, November. We're going to be launching three realms. We're going to have a Veteran Insane Realm uh, and a Veteran Realm uh, for Desktop and a veteran, veteran Realm for Mobile. Now the Veteran Insane Realm basically is like Realm 100. Uh, virtually no changes there. Uh, we haven't heard any negative complaints from it. It's really lived up to its name as insane because it is, does seem to be insane. But um, those of you who love it, love it. So we're going to have a realm just like that uh, for you guys. Now, the uh, both of veteran realms, the desktop and mobile and the mobile only, will have the new feature, the morale feature that we've introduced and we, um, uh, we basically demoed uh, recently in a video. So um, it will have that uh, new morale system, which basically limits um, or throttles how much you can spend playing per day and um, get a big advantage from doing so. But a few things uh, are also going to be different. So one thing we're going to do is we're going to give out a couple of unique avatars, which have some bit of a humor in, in them, kind of fun thing, uh, once you reach, I think, a level of count or so. And we'll also be able to make other changes like speed. We're able to increase the speed of the realm uh, from 1.5x to 2.x. Um, in comparison, the Veteran Insane Realm is 2.5, so we're getting quite close to that. This is the speed of recruitment, how long you have to wait for troops, how long you have to wait for silver. We're also going to be changing the sleep uh, mode activation time from the one hour, which was experimental in some of the new realms. Uh, feedback we got from you guys was that it's perhaps a little bit too aggressive, perhaps it's a bit too easy to run away from an attack. So with the new morale system, it's not so important, and we can um, increase it to a two-hour activation uh, time. We're also going to be lowering the handicap. In fact, the change we're going to make to the handicap will be we'll make the handicap the same across all the realms. So the handicap in the veteran realm will be the same as in veteran insane realm. An example of uh, of the change is that while in a veteran realm the maximum maximum handicap was 75%, uh, we're going to lower that to 50%. So both veteran insane and veteran realm will have a maximum handicap of 50%. And also how fast it increases. What's the um, difference in points you have to have in order for it to kick in changes uh, is changing to be like in the handicap realm uh, sorry <laughs> like in the uh, veteran insane realm we're also able to um, uh, change the desertion uh, factor and lower that a little bit as you know that in realm 100 we've uh, increased the desertion factor so that you um, you lose much more uh, troops much uh, quicker when you attack over long distances and that is there to um, limit fake attacks that you can do over longer distances uh, so that we haven't had, had any negative complaints about that. In fact, some of the complaints we had was that it worked. It did limit um, number of fakes on uh, Realm 100. So we're leaving it the way it is on the Veteran Insane Realm. But on the Veteran Realm with the morale system, we feel that we can lower it. So we're lowering it almost to the levels um, before the Realm 100. Now also caravans changing. Um, it's going to be 10 caravans per day. The Veteran Realm is uh, meant for people with less time. So we want to make sure that you can collect uh, all the caravans easily per day. So it's going to be now 10 per day. And of course, um, the cards pay out much more than they did before. We've also added a bunch of cards. Everything's been reworked, their probabilities and everything to make it more fun and to make it work. So those will be the realms that are coming in just under two weeks. Now, you might be wondering, uh, what about the, uh, the troop morale system, the new system? Uh, what are they going to be? What are the parameters going to be? Uh, well, there's going to be more about that in uh, next video coming right up. If for those who are interested in details, but basically we're uh, setting a um, parameter such that our target is about one uh, hour per day in play. So what does that mean exactly? You have to wait for the next video. Until then, happy hunting.